If this game didn't speed your heart rate up, I don't know what could. An 86th minute penalty kick winner from Ryan Raposo seals Syracuse's fate. They go on to the second round to take on St. John's. And here's how it happened. Rhode Island, they got started real early off of a corner. Petter Christensen with a service in. Filippo Tamburini finished. And in general, Rhode Island had more quality opportunities in this game than Syracuse, especially early on, but then the orange strike back. And then on a set piece again, the header in from Luther Archimede. It did cross that white line. Stefan Schmidt couldn't get paused to it early enough. That tied the game at one. And then here was the call that maybe defined this game right now. Severin Sorley, it looked like he was off sides, but then he found a slashing Ryan Raposo. There's no neon in the way of that. Almost certainly off sides, and that took Stefan Schmidt off his line trying to get to Sorley, and Raposo calmly puts it in the back of the net. Then right here, Noam Kolakowski, one of the transfers from Franklin Pierce. He nodded this game at two in the second half, but here's the foul right here in the 86th minute. Hilly Goldhar with the ball in. Luther Archimede tried to get to it, and then that was Charlie Booth, the grad transfer, and Ryan Raposo, the sophomore sensation, finishes lower left corner for Syracuse. Ryan Raposo is the guy. He waves bye-bye to Rhode Island and waves his way on to the second round of the NCAA tournament. Syracuse among the top teams in accruing corners in the entire country. No corners, and they still won this game. Fantastic performance today from Syracuse. They had limited opportunities, but they finished them with high-quality finishes. Also a great game from Christian Miesch. He makes five saves on the way to the second round. Early, too. He was fantastic. Now Syracuse advances to take on St. John's in Queens, one of the five boroughs on Sunday. And then Virginia, they host the Campbell Camels in Charlottesville on Sunday as well. Those two winners will meet on either November 30 or December 1. Syracuse with a big win over Rhode Island in the first round of the NCAA Men's Soccer Tournament. For J.D. Rachi, I'm Jack McMullen. 3-2, your final.